Wanted to know the difference between Moonstone and Opal. You're in the right place. Moonstone shows adolescence, whereas opals show opalescence. Opals show a rainbow of colors, whereas moonstone glow white or blue. There are no lab-created moonstones, whereas lab-created opal is common. Opals can go for thousands of dollars, whereas fine quality moonstone goes for hundreds. Moonstone. There are two types of moonstone out there. Most people familiar with the stone don't realize rainbow moonstone is not the same as natural moonstone. They also might not know that Rainbow Moonstone isn't a moonstone at all. Rainbow Moonstone is part of the Labradorite gemstone species. Moonstones are an orthoclase variety. Natural Moonstone is made up of two minerals, albite and orthoclase. Both Moonstone and Rainbow Moonstone are part of the Feldspar group, but they are more like cousins. Natural Moonstone gemstones can be found in Sri Lanka, India, Australia, Mexico. Most Rainbow Moonstone comes from India and Madagascar. Moonstones are one of top trendiest stones in gemstone jewelry. They're most associated with the moon. Go figure. Ancient cultures believed moonstones were solidified moonbeams captured into a gemstone. They also believe moonstone jewelry to be a feminine stone. Many women wore moonstone to increase fertility and protect their children. Today, the spiritual properties of moonstone are said to help with fertility, new beginnings, parenting, inner purity, healing your inner self, bringing confidence, enhancing intuition, and dispelling negative emotions. Vivid Opal is another popular gemstone today. Many people are familiar with it as the birthstone for the month of October. It's also the national gem of Australia. Many opals are found in the Australian subcontinent. Opal gems are formed in compounds of silicon dioxide and then found in water to pop. After the tiny silica spheres form, different minerals mix with them when water flows through area. The minerals are tumbled by the water, creating opal stones. The minerals tumbled also mix with other non-opal material to create opalized wood. Jasper opal, agate opal, and opalized petrified wood. When opals are still left in their original matrix stone, they're called boulder opals. Opal jewelry is more popular than using opals for their healing properties. Still, it's believed that opal intensifies emotions and has a high vibrational energy. It is believed to bring balance, increase energy and creativity, as well as bringing good karma. Moonstone. Genuine moonstone occurs in a variety of colors, but the most sought after ones are white and blue moonstone. Other colors of moonstone include white, beige, brown, creamy yellow, reddish brown, gray, blue, peach, and pink. A rainbow moonstone crystal has a translucent to transparent white body color with rainbow flashes. Moonstones with white and blue color flashes have adolescence, a type of Schiller effect. To show this optical phenomenon, the stones must be cut into cabochons. If tilted at certain angles under direct light, you'll see a bright blue flash in the stone. This is caused by scattered light passing through the stone. White moonstones tend to have more of a faint glow. Opals are characterized for their translucent milky white body color. However, not all opals are white. The most prized opals come from Lightning Ridge, Australia. Black opals are the most valuable, which have a dark blue to gray color. Mexican opals, also known as fire opals, have an orange base color. Both moonstone and precious opal are cut in cabochon in order to display their color flash. The exception to this is Mexican opals, which are faceted for their fiery orange gems. Moonstones have adolescence, but opals have opalescence. The chemical structure of the opal will diffract light, causing color flashes. No two opals are the same. When you angle an opal, you see its play of color. Different patterns occur across the body color. Generally, you will see yellow, green, and orange colors across the surface. Opals with play of color are called precious opals. Lab-created opals are commonly found at mall jewelry retailers like K and Zales. You can find both blue opal and pink opal at these stores. Pink opal is lab-created, but there is such thing as a blue opal. Blue Peruvian opals have a bluish-green body color, but no play of color. Lab-created blue opals have play of color. The biggest imitation gemstones for opals are opalite and rainbow moonstone. Opalite is a man-made glass with an iridescence. They don't exude any color flashes and are significantly less valuable than a precious opal. Rainbow Moonstone and opal can look a lot alike, especially if both are faceted. Rainbow Moonstone doesn't have the same bright flashes as precious opal. The prices between a moonstone and opal differ depending on the quality. The feldspar group is one of the most widespread minerals in the world. Low-quality moonstones are very common, but high-quality ones are not. Still, even a rare Ceylon moonstone with strong adulations goes for around $40 per carat. Opals are a different story. The cost of an opal is more of an art than a science. 
opals aren't rare, but stones with uncommon patterns may be valued more. Black opals are the most valuable. Fine color specimens can go for up to $8,000 per carat. Lab-created opals are very affordable, less than $50 per carat. Fire opals go for around $100 per carat. Overall, opals can run between $50 to $8,000 per carat. An opal isn't a very hard stone, neither is moonstone. Even though many express desires of wanting opals and moonstones for engagement rings, it's not a great idea. Both stones are easily scratched. We are going to end this video right away. If you have any query or information to share, please leave a comment below. Thanks for watching.